There she's in the bag again. My name is Vanner Pukert, and this is Finding Frequency. Uh, another long day done and dusted, but uh, started off, or maybe I should uh, go right back to a main road where the last episode stopped on my way to a post office. And what was I about to get? An awesome gift from my friend Mike in Madrid, also a fellow South African. Mike decided to send me a book of poems, and um, the poems are written in a very humoristic way, and um, it's actually a book that I can read with little Francie, so I'm super excited for Francie to come back from his trip so we can indulge in this awesome little gift that Mike has sent along. And it also comes at the just the perfect time, because it's been a tough time, and as I mentioned, we all spoke about... Um, kind of this mental fatigue and then you have this little gift that um, can be used to create a little bit of an experience between uh, a father and his son. So what an awesome gift. And then the rest of Friday kind of played out in a strange way, starting off with a very good presentation um, with a potential client, um, shared some ideas it seemed to have resonated and um, I got some good feedback so that was great and then the rest of the day um, kind of spent in preparation for the live stream that went for one and a half hours way too long way too long but it was fun and um, the thing is with these live streams what is strange is that it's it's not really like a podcast like this where um, you know, try and make it episodic, not take too much time and get to the point quickly. You have this flexibility for the live stream to go. Length is not really important. It's just the interaction. And in a way, you want to give people the opportunity to dip in and out, to peek into what is being done. And I think even though it was a bit long in the beginning and perhaps in the end, I'm still learning how to be more succinct. I think in the middle when we were working on this design, it could have been interesting for some people at some stages. So it was interesting and uh, the the girl that was uh, interviewed or actually facilitated on stage, stage from the Netherlands, she was just having a great time and she also gave me the same feedback afterwards. So... You know, if, if one person walked away really enjoying it, then I'm super, super happy. Um, yeah, still lots to work on. And um, I, th I think also the outcome of this <laughs> session was actually really, really useful. We were exploring the purpose of doing these live streams. So, yeah, it was, I was, it was fun. I, I'd like to do it a little bit shorter. Uh, but for now, I'm happy. Um, as long as there's room to fix things and tweak things and just mess around, why not? Why the hell not? Um, I'm just going to keep on doing it. So, um, yeah, home alone. Marta and Francie is in the, in the countryside, in the mountains, having a good time. Um, I'm getting updates all the time from Marta. So the next couple of days I'm going to be... On my own means I can rest a little bit, which I'm definitely going to do and catch up on a few things. I've got a few chores that my wife left me and then also catch up with a few friends that um, I'm only able to, able to really catch over the weekend so I can do this. Well, I hope you've got something cool planned for the weekend. It's on. Thanks for listening. <laughs>